Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you guys how to sell crypto on Binance US. So there are currently three methods on how to sell crypto on Binance US and I'm just going to go through each of them. Okay, so while you're looking at your portfolio at the top right, you can see the yellow button with arrows pointing in opposite directions. So click on that and then at that point you could click on buy crypto or sell crypto. So we're going to click on sell crypto. So let's just use Cardano for all of the demonstrations. So look through all of your crypto that you currently own and then select that, the one that you want to sell. So we're going to sell Cardano. So at the top right, you can see how many shares of the coin you currently owe. Uh, you could choose to input either US dollars or however many coins you have. So right now I have a set of US dollars. For example, I could just type in like, I want to sell $10 worth of Cardano and under the $10, you can see that I would sell seven shares of Cardano for $10. Okay, so let's say I want to sell 20 shares of Cardano. So here um, along the right hand side, you'll see the arrows pointing in opposite directions in ADA. So click on that. And now I could just type in, I want to sell 20 shares of Cardano. And at the bottom, you can see how much money I'll receive after selling 20 shares. So on the right hand side now you see the arrows pointing in opposite directions you could switch back and forth between i want to type in how much us dollars i want to get out of this sale or i want to tell you i only want to sell 20 shares of cardano so see i can switch back and forth between a us dollar value or how many shares of cardano i want to sell and i just want to give you guys a quick preview of what the screen looks like so let's say i'm going to sell one share of cardano i'll receive a dollar and 47 cents so let's click on preview sell. And I just realized through this method, you have to sell at least $20 worth in order for your sale to go through. So keep that in mind for this method. Going back to your portfolio screen, along the very bottom, you'll see multiple icons. We're going to sell via market order now. So select the bar graph icon bottom left. So click on that. Here you can see multiple options at the top. You want to make sure you have selected USD, which stands for US dollars because we're going to sell Cardano for US dollars. So I off the top of my head know that Cardano's ticker is ADA. So I'm just going to search it at the top right. Click on that magnifying glass and I'm going to search for ADA. So here you want to make sure that you're selecting like ADA slash US dollars or if you're selling Bitcoin like BTC slash US dollars because if you select one of the other uh, you'll either sell your crypto for that particular currency like if I select ADA slash USDT I'll be selling it for Tether and if I select ADA slash BTC I'll be selling my Cardano and receiving Bitcoin. So we're going to select ADA slash US dollars because we want to sell Cardano for US dollars. Click on that. Here we're brought to this screen here. And at the bottom right, you'll see buy or sell. Obviously for this video, we're going to click on sell. Okay. For market order, you only have the option of putting the amount of your cryptocurrency that you're trying to sell. So let's say I'm trying to sell 20 shares of Cardano. As you can see there, I have available to me 148. I do not want to actually sell my Cardano. I just wanted to show you guys how to get to these screens. Um, you can see that you could also sell like percentages of how much is in your portfolio. Let's say I'm trying to sell 25% of my Cardano. I just click on that 25% or I'm trying to sell 50%, 75% or I'm just trying to sell all of my Cardano. I click on that 100% button and it will sell your Cardano for whatever the current market price is. At the very top, you can see the current market price is $1.52. Uh, while you're going through the sell order, while you have the market tab selected, it's just going to sell for whatever the current market price is. So it could sell for like $1.51, $1.52. Uh, it could drop real quick and even sell for like $1.40, depending on what the mar market price is as the order is going through. Now, if you don't want to sell it through the market price and you want to set a limit like, hey, I want to sell Cardano at $1.55. So we're going to select limit. Okay, here you could actually select like what price point you want it at. So let's say, like I said earlier, I want to sell Cardano at $1.55 and I'm going to sell, let's say 50 shares. So here you're guaranteed like I'm going to sell Cardano once it hits like $1.55 
and I'm gonna get $77.50 out of this sale. Whereas if you're selling through market, you could sell Cardano for like 150, 140, 145, you, you just don't know. So personally, I prefer selling through limit orders just so that you can get the exact price point you want. But keep in mind, after you click on place sell order and the price continues to drop, it's not gonna fulfill because you're telling Binance that you only want to sell your Cardano if it hits $1.55. If it never hits $1.55, then your order will just kind of be hanging out there and will just be waiting for Cardano to hit that price point. You could always cancel your limit orders if it never fulfills or you decide you just want to hold it for a longer term, but just keep that in mind. And again, here you could select like 25%, 50%, 75% of the total amount of Cardano that's in your account or whatever cryptocurrency you're trying to sell. Okay, so let's say you place a limit order and it hasn't fulfilled and you just want to cancel it. So at the bottom right hand side, you'll see the person icon and then that paper icon. You're going to click on that paper icon and here is where you'll see your open orders. So let's say I place a limit order for $1.55 for Cardano and the price has kept dropping and it never fulfilled. It will show up here and here is where you're going to be able to cancel it if you decide I don't want to sell it anymore or you just want to hold it, whatever. Or if you want to change the limit price instead of like $1.55, you're like, okay, I'll sell it for $140. So you can modify your order here as well. So if this video helped you out, be sure to hit that like button. And if you don't already have a Binance account, feel free to sign up using my referral link and you'll get some kickbacks on your fees. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later.